Shock and disbelief continue to blanket the Princeton athletic fields after Ethan Trejo collapsed, never regaining consciousness. Yesterday evening, a soccer conditioning was wrapping up. 16-year-old Trejo, according to dispatch reports, fell to the ground, seizing. I have a kid down at Princeton Viking Stadium. <laughs> yeah, yeah. having a seizure. Trejo would be rushed from the turf field by ambulance to Children's Hospital's Liberty Campus, where he would be pronounced dead. He just got down. We were having a scrimmage, and he went down. I went to check on him. He was laying down. Okay. I called his name. He was unresponsive. He started seizing. In a statement, Princeton City School Superintendent Tom Burton said CPR and other efforts were administered until medical personnel arrived but we're unable to save the young life lost. We join our Princeton family, friends, classmates, and our community as we grieve the loss of a life taken too soon. Burton's statement of hope and healing read, social media posts from friends and family shared Ethan's love for soccer. One post from his brother Colin said, Ethan is now playing with the legends of FIFA and the World Cup. Our soccer conditioning had only been going on for just about a week. This tragic death again right now pending the investigation from the autopsy in the coroner's office. But right now, grief counselors say that they will remain available as long as they are needed. Reporting live in Sharonville, Richard Childs, WLWT News 5.